Tired of dropping your phone or struggling to prop it up? Meet the Pop Sockets Phone Grip with expanding kickstand in black, your new must-have accessory. Don't miss out. Grab yours today. Click the link in the video description to shop now on Amazon. So, you've probably heard by now that Amazon is planning to ditch its trusty old Android OS on Fire TVs and make a switch to its own Linux-based OS called Vega. Now, we know Amazon has been working on this for a while, but it looks like the company's finally ready to take the leap. According to a new report, Amazon will release its first TV streaming device powered by Vega OS later this year, marking a significant change in how Fire TVs work. But what does this mean for users, and why is Amazon making the switch? Well, one thing's for sure, sideloading apps on Fire TVs is going to be a lot more complicated from now on. For those who may not know, sideloading allows you to download and run apps that aren't available through the regular app store. It's been a popular feature among users, especially those who want to access third-party apps like Kodi or IPTV emulators. But under Vega OS, Sideloading is going to be limited to apps specifically made for the new platform. Now, we know Amazon hasn't officially announced Vega OS yet, but it looks like the company's already started rolling out the software to some of its devices, including the Echo Show 5, Echo Hub, and Echo Spot. And according to job listings, Amazon's courting major publishers to bring their apps on board for this new platform. So, what does this mean for users? Well, it means that if you want to access certain apps or services on your Fire TV, you're going to have to do so through the App Store. It's a bit of a blow, especially for those who rely on sideloading for their favorite streaming services. But Amazon's not just making this switch for the sake of it. The company wants to make sure its users have access to all the latest and greatest apps, and with Vega OS, they're hoping to do just that. Of course, only time will tell if this move is going to pay off for Amazon. As we look ahead to the release of Fire TVs powered by Vega OS, it's clear that Amazon's walking a bit of a fine line between innovation and user satisfaction. Will this change be enough to keep users on board, or will it drive them away? Only time will tell.